Hello and welcome back. When's the last time you guys clean out the grip head on your Brista Express? So the grip head is right on, uh, so right here on your uh, photo filter going into. So that's the group, uh, grip head if you guys uh, may not know. So here's what happened. Okay. The, the reason why I like to clean the grip head at least once a month, everything's all clean here. I'm going to show you something. Every morning you guys turn on the machine and then we are going to start making coffee. The thing is, I'm going to just uh, pull the dummy shot here. So you see kind of a little murky of water that smells like bad coffee. So this is reason why I would like to I like to clean the grip at least once a month. So this morning I'm going to show you how to do it. The first thing we're gonna do is shut the machine off. You know what? Just better, yeah. Just unplug it. Okay. And then just simply remove the photo filter. The great thing about the Brista Express, they give you all the cleaning tools. Okay. So just remove the back of the tray. You're gonna see this Allen wrench there. And then I'm gonna show you what uh, you need to do. So take your Allen wrench, go underneath here. You just gotta, here we go, and twist it. And then, so this is tricky to come out, okay? So what I like to do is I like to use the some kind of sharp object. I'm I'm gonna use this. I'm just gonna twist it. go in there and prying open like that, like this. So, so I took it out. As you can see from here, so this is pretty messy. Okay, you see the, all the black uh, coffee stain. So at this point. So I have a container with uh, water in it. It's just, just the regular water. And just simply dump it in here. I'm just clean it, okay? Just to use a paper towel. And it's very, very simple. And do that like once a month. I mean, look at this. And I'm just gonna soak it in for a little bit. Meantime, uh, just get another clean paper towel. Just wet a little bit, just wet, just like wet towel, and then just clean right in, on the top of it. Okay. Inside the group head, just clean it. Like this, so. Everything's come out like this. So pretty much we are drinking this every morning. So, you know, you might wanna clean it as often as possible. Uh, Again, well, I do once a month, and uh, I know some people do once a week, but I guess, you know, more is the better at this point. Uh, just let me know in the comment how often you guys clean this. Okay, at this time, I'm just going to take a look on the bottom. That looks good to me. And then, uh, let's see. At this time, I'm just going to clean it one more time and just put it back in, like this. So, got my screws on. Just put back it into the hole there. Now we are ready to make some coffee. So let's take a look. You can see from the, my demonstration, it's a very, very simple process to clean. So let's take a look. So before uh, we see a little murky uh, water, and now everything's all clear. So it doesn't smell like old, uh, old stained coffee smell. 
just smells like just regular water. So we are good to go at this point. Uh, please let me know in the comment what what uh, what do you guys think about the cleaning process? Uh, is that easy or simple, uh, easy or hard for you? And also just let me know how often you guys clean this. And uh, what else? Uh, if you like this video, please thumbs up for me. And then uh, this week, I'm going to review a few more products as well. I just got a new, the revised 3D uh, dosing funnel from Jonathan. So I'm going to showcase that too. So, and then also I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to use the flare uh, machine for the first time as well. And oh, don't forget to follow me on the Instagram and see you guys next time.